Hello, hello, hello. Happy Friday to you. Welcome back. Uh, yeah, what, what are we doing today? I don't know. We're doing this page. We did this page yesterday, our uh, previous video, previous one to that was that. And so now we're going to do this page. And so that when we flip it over, these are the circles that we're going to see through there. We're going to just plan something out so that this makes an amazing thing through that. Don't know what I'm going to do. So I'm going to just get inspired by using Alina Light's uh, deck of cards. And we're just going to pick one and we're going to make it work. Let's, let's mix these up a little bit. Let's mix these up a little bit because... Not that it makes any difference because I don't know which one's coming next, but we're gonna we're gonna mix them up just a little bit just so that you guys know I am not. It is whatever the universe wants me to have for today. I am feeling this one. That's what we're gonna do today. Let's see what it is together, shall we? Hopefully, it's something that will work great. Oh, look at that. It's called man, M-A-A-N. Isn't that pretty? How cool is that? So first thing we're going to do is start with a circle. Then we're going to do a little aura around it and then another aura around it like that. And then that from there, we can do a variety of things where we can put little lines, we can put pearls. It almost looks like a, uh, a ring. I think I'm going to do it in the middle of here. Let's see. How do I want to do that? If I start with a small circle and then I build out to, to that size... So I want my circle, do I want my circle here? You can't see a thing. Let me zoom the other direction so you can hear my thought processes with my... So do I want them to come like... See how in her mandala they come this way? I do like that. Shall we do one where it comes like, like this? And one where it's got more pointy leaves. I think so. And we're going to have one come this way and one come this way. And they're going to kind of come this direction. So let's, let's think about this. We're going to have it kind of come like that and like this. So my circle is going to be about there. And this one, the circle is going to be about here. I think so. This one's going to be the kind that comes this way with some pearls coming up like that. And this one's going to be the kind that comes with a more spiky. And then I like... I like that with this kind of a thing like that. Something like that. We have we have planned in our head. Is that what's going to actually look like when we're done? I doubt it. But we've planned. All right, let's let's put this like this cuz it makes it easier for me to draw. And it's going to be, I want it to go this way, though. Okay, so this has to go this direction. I must say, drawing inside this book is a challenge. I gotta, And then i got to put it where you guys can see what I'm doing, too. Ah, what a mess. Okay. I think I'm running out of ink with this one. It's hard.
hard to tell. Didn't I just put ink in this one? I don't know that I did. I think I put it in the five. Yeah, I put it in the five. I should mark these when I do them as to what day I put them. All right. You know what? If I have more ink, I'm going to put... Do I have more ink? Yes. Okay, I need to order more ink cartridges. I'm going to just switch out my ink on this one, too. And I'm going to mark... I'm going to put a date. I'll put a little piece of tape. little piece of tape on here so I can mark the date. Seven. Okay. I'm going to assume that I need more ink because it's all... It's like dry. Just do that. Oh, you can't do it with a piece of paint. fudge. Well, can I put it down here? Or does it not go down at all? It's very highly precise. I put a little piece of um, blue tape with the date. And now it won't go in. Let me see if it'll go down here. I tried it up here and it won't go in. Will it go in down there? No. Okay. Can't do that. Alrighty then. We will mark it on the outside. Alright. So now I'm just going to put a mark on the outside of when I change my ink on the inside. All right, let's try that. Oh, considerably better. Okay, yep, it was dry. All right, so what am I doing? I'm doing this. I have already forgotten where I was at. I'm sorry. Got a little AD, ADD on you. Okay, so let's do a circle here. Like that. And then we're going to do this that goes all the way around like that. And then the next one goes higher like that. Can you see that? You are very far away. And if I zoom you in, then I am not in the right place. Scooch you over. Ay, ay, ay. Telling you, drawing on this in the book after it's been put together is a challenge. But I'm doing it for you guys. Because, no, actually, I'm doing it for my husband because he really, really wanted me to do another on the other side. Uh... I want some kind of a, a V shape. So we're going to come here.
Now I think I'm going to go like that. And then I'm going to do it like this. Something like that. There's a something, some sort of flaw in the paper right there. It made me have a bump. But that's okay. So we're going to go like that. And then coming up up I want those pearls because I think I like those pearls so we're gonna go like this and I'm gonna go like that and then we're gonna go here and then we're gonna go here and like this and then I think we want something coming up this way. Something like that? Sure. Sure, that looks like fun. Uh, I think I want this to go like that, though. Something like this. Like that. Yeah, like that. Okay, so that is that's that one. Let me let me zoom out so you guys can see the whole thing. Something like this. And then this one is going to go this way. Like that. And then it's going to come this uh, like this something like that and then I can't reach like that. Okay, let's try it like this. Then we're gonna go, we're gonna do one more like this. that. 
something like that. Can you see? Am I way off the page? Yes, I am. You can't see. Something in that general shape. One more, I think. I think I am going to put leaves here. like so, and then coming up here, Kind of looks like a thistle. All right, I like that, but I feel like it's overall as a composition, it's like way down here. It needs something up here. So I am going to put a third one up here. You're not going to see it in the window, but that's okay. I make it smaller. to start with. Okay. And then it needs some sort of fun little spike that comes out here with a How about something like that? That's kind of fun. Maybe with some 
orbs as well. Kind of a, a hybrid something or other. Okay, I'm, I'm happy with that. All right, let's, let's erase all of our pencil mess and then do some shading. I don't remember. Do I have color? Yes, I do have color. I have color on these pages going on the other way. So I think I might put some color on this one. can't get my pencil mark off. Where's my bigger eraser? I made my circles a little more dark so you could see them. They're hard to get off. Okay. This one is called M-A-A-N and I'm putting the names up the side one side or the other. We're going to do it this way, I think, on these ones. Okay. I think I want some shading like that. Can you guys see what I'm doing? Am I too far away? I might be. I want just a little bit of, of pencil down there. A little bit around here. Just a little bit here. Because when I blend it out, it will it will make the the shading that i want and then these for sure need what's my watch telling me a little bit of something here like that okay now blending stump where are you there you are we're going to start over here and I am going to put white because I like that combination. I 
I could have been a little more precise with my shading. Could have taken a little bit more time. But I haven't. Because if I don't like it, I can always erase and try again, you know? But once I put my highlights on here, you'll never notice that my shadows are kind of haphazard. We're getting there, folks. We're getting there. I want to at least today get this page and the and the other one done as I draw today. I'm trying to get super ahead. I am actually planning to have take most of December off. So I really want to be, and I actually am planning on doing uh, Inktober this year. Um, I'm not going to follow the prompts. I'm just going to draw every single day in October. So in order to do that, I have to have like a lot ahead. Okay. Was I off screen most of that time? Probably, because I wasn't paying attention. I want blue, but I think I think this might end up being the wrong shade of blue. I think I might want a more turquoisey blue. So I'm gonna put down this color to start. But I think I want I think I want an actual more turquoisey blue. Let me add this blue, which is called teal green light yeah that's more what I want and I'm just gonna put the color on these like pearl parts And then we're going to do white. Let's okay, let's do a little, little white shine on there. like that. Can you see that? I think you can. And then we're going to do a little white shine on these pearls. And on these pearls. And then we're going to highlight our little petals. It's not a lot of white, but it's just enough 
to cause your eye to say, oh, look at that. Just like that. Okay. A little bit more. Let's turn this around so I can get to it easier. Like I've said many times, coloring in this book is a little challenging. If you like what I'm doing, I wouldn't be in, uh, I would be appreciative if you would hit like and subscribe if you don't like this content I'm serious if you don't like this content and what I've been doing with the dot journal please hit the thumbs down I know it sounds like a strange thing for I, I want you to do but please do that way I'll know that this isn't the type of content you guys want to see and I will uh, react accordingly all right there we go isn't that pretty? That's pretty. And then what will we see through the dots? We will see that through the dots. That's cool. Okay, I like that. And then we'll, we'll do something different coming out from there for the dots. What we're going to do, I don't rightly know, but that's what we're going to do. This one is called M-A-A-N from Alina Light. So if you want to follow her, her links are in the description box below. If you want her cards, her link is also still in the description box below. Go to Alina's page, and then in her description box, she tells you how to get um, the cards if you want them. Um, I will see you guys on the next video. That will be Monday. So have a great weekend. You guys have a blessed day. Go out and do something nice for someone today. Make the world a better place one person at a time. And I will see you later. Bye-bye.